Hello Freedom High School and happy Thursday. I'm Carly Grosher. And I'm Jalen Story. Welcome to the Freedom Forum's daily newscast. Today is Thursday, September 6, 2018. It is a day two. So Carly, how's our weather looking today? There will be sporadic thunderstorms in the morning and possibly the afternoon. The high temperature will be 91 degrees. Thanks Carly. Let's get back to our announcements. Did you know that BASD has its own TV channel? You can view it on RCN Channel 67 or Service Electric Channel 265. Check out our newscasts and student-created videos later this month. Also, did you know that Freedom students can purchase Atlanta bus pass? Please see Ms. Kirkpatrick in the main office if you're interested in doing so. Did you know that Freedom has a food and clothing pantry? Any student in need of school supplies, clothes, hygiene products, or food, please stop in the guidance office to speak to your guidance counselor. Anyone who is interested in being part of the debate team this year should come to our first meeting today, September 6th, after school in room 213. This year's topic is U.S. immigration policy. If you are interested but cannot make the meeting, see Ms. Marmoros in room 213. Let's head back over to Tristan for more on debate. Hey guys, I'm here with Quentin Jimenez, one of the captains on the debate team. Uh, he's going to tell us a little bit about, about debate team and what they do. So the debate team, there's four sub-teams on the debate team. consists of four people with four different roles. There's speaker one, speaker two, rebuttalist and questioner, and they all have different roles. The speakers write their speeches and speak, speak, they speak their speeches. The questioners question the other team speakers and the rebuttalist ends the debate with his own speech that is half written at the debate. Uh, what are some things you like about the debate team and what do you think other people will enjoy? What I like about the debate team, besides getting out of class, right, right. is just how much thinking it requires. It requires knowing what the other team's thinking, it requires knowing the topic, and it requires your ability to speak, to speak in front of people. Right. Thank you. Back to you guys. Avita will be selling bracelets for $2 in the cafeteria. Crafts for Kindness is looking for, our, for new members. Our first meeting will be on Thursday, September 13th, after school in room 211. All are welcome to join us in making crafts to deliver to local hospital patients. The club will meet every Thursday throughout the year. There will be a short organizational meeting for any students interested in joining the FHS Garden Club after school today in Mrs. Brokowski's room, Science Wing 160. New participants are welcome and no experience with gardening is necessary. Engineering Club will meet Tuesday, September 11th at 2.35 in the engineering room. New students are always welcome. DECA Business Club will be meeting in room 814 from 2.40 to 3 o'clock on Tuesday, September 11th. Please attend the meeting if you are interested in joining the club. If you cannot attend, please see Mrs. Spang at 814. Come on out to the FHS French Club meeting in room 131 after school today, Thursday, September 6th. The first meeting of the Gay Straight Alliance will also be today after school in room 214. All orientations and identities welcome. Everyone is invited to join Hacky Sack Club's first circle on Monday, September 10th in the main lobby at the end of the day. Hop in. Calling all photographers. The Morning Call is running an amateur scholastic digital photography contest for middle and high school students. It's open to ages 13 through 18 and there are four prize categories. Winners will be featured in the Morning Call. The deadline for submissions is September 23rd. Go to themorningcall.com slash envision for more information. Did you know that BASD now has an app to allow you to stay connected with the school district? The new BASD mobile app will contain important information about the going on in the district, including safety and emergency messages. The app is available at the Apple App Store and Google App Store. Would you like to develop or enhance your leadership skills, become an active member of the community in learning military movements and drills? Maybe you're just looking to join a club that allows you to challenge yourself both mentally and physically. If you answered yes, come to the Junior ROTC meeting on Tuesday, September 11th after school in the Principal's Conference Room. The homecoming dance will be held on September 22nd in the Old Gym from 7 to 10 p.m. Tickets will be $15 and be sold outside of lunches from September 11th to September 18th. Guest forms are required to be completed and present to purchase guest tickets. So Carly, what's up with sports today? Freedom High School football team will play their third game this Friday night, September 7th. Come on out to Frank Banco Field to watch them beat Parkland High School. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. The Ride Squad's theme for this week is 70s. Don't forget your tie-dye and bell-bottoms. The, the FHF golf team faces Whitehall at home today at 2.30. Also, girls field hockey will play East Strasburg South at home today at 4.
That's all for today, Freedom. Thank you for tuning in to our daily newscast. I'm Carly. And I'm Jalen, reporting for the Freedom Forum, a voice for the voices since 1967.